What's up you amazing hackers? I hope you're all doing well today. So I have the amazing hacker Matt here with me. How are you doing my friend? I'm good. I have a great day with my friends. I was on a trip. Uh, it was 20 kilometers long. So I'm very tired. I can believe that man. That's really yeah. cool. So uh, you do a lot of try hack me I've seen um, you're pretty good at it like what was the do you learn a lot from try hack me are you still learning from it yeah sure so I'm not good <laughs> I'm just learning uh, I mainly on hack the box so mm -hmm. I in the back in the before I watched a lot of it's, it's like the right of videos yeah and he does the boxes you know Mm -hmm. and I love uh, then I discovered Try Hack Me and uh, also like the box and uh, Try Hack Me is a very good platform in my opinion Hack the box is a, it's a little bit intense but uh, I like the boat I like both yeah especially the battlegrounds from Hack the Box they are really cool as well but as you say Try Hack Me is a perfect platform to learn how to hack as well they have and, uh, perfect platform for everything you know there are yeah. uh, hardware hacking uh, printer hacking for example exactly. and that's uh, very interesting that's really cool man so do you spend a lot of time doing this how much time yeah. would you um, sorry uh, i would say uh, i spend uh, five hours a day maybe five hours a day every day or uh, not every day in the weekend Okay. Uh, uh, in weekdays, I say I spend uh, two or three hours. Okay, that's really uh, cool, man. Uh, learning and uh, just a little bit of hacking. And this might be a weird question, but what do you do for relaxing? Uh, what? Like, if you want to chill a little bit, do you so, hack or like, like if you're completely tired of hacking, do you have any other hobbies? Yeah, sure. I'm playing with my dog, or uh, I'm just listening to music and just lay down the bed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because hacking is really stressful. Like, yeah. I don't know. But, uh, it's uh, what did uh, Katie said? Uh, deep work. Yeah, that's deep work. Deep, deep work, and that's uh, really, uh, really hard for your brain. So you have to rest a little bit after doing uh, some deep work. Well, I do mostly, uh, sorry. Uh, you just say it. I do mostly bug bounties, of course, and bug bounties is a lot more stressful because you're looking for a needle in a haystack often, and that's very stressful. That's why I like Try Hack Me so much. If you do Try Hack Me, you know that there's a vulnerability, and that's why it's so cool. Do you, yeah. do you often play games like King of the Hill as well, or is it... Uh, Mainly it's uh, boxes, but uh, sometimes King of the Hill also. And uh, yeah, that's a uh, main point because uh, I love that uh, option to there is a flag somewhere and there is a vulnerability for sure. Awesome. And that's the reason why I'm bad with bug on this. Because <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I think, in my opinion, I, uh, I give up very fast. And that's a, that's a big problem. Yeah, that's in bug bounties. You really have to be persistent, and you really have to push through. But are you planning on getting OSCP, maybe? Uh, yeah. Uh, but that's... Then I will have uh, enough money <laughs> to buy the OSCP. I would really uh, advise you to learn how to push through. You know how to try harder. Yes, yes. I'm uh, currently doing <laughs> some challenge. Uh, it's a uh, for 100 days, so I do oh, yeah. many ports with the labs, uh, five days a week, and uh, like Hacking them said, and two hours a day, and uh, I rest on the weekends, and uh, on weekends I usually play try me because uh, it's fun and it's easy, uh, for easy boxes, I mean. Yeah, exactly, man, that's why I really love doing it as well. You know that you're going to find the vulnerability, of course, so that's Absolutely. why it's useful. And like, also uh, hack the box. I really like hack the box because 
it teaches you a lot of skills as well. I, I think you can vouch for that. Like, I believe that these platforms really do help create better ethical hackers. Yeah, and the methodology too. So, and I uh, learned that Tom from Hack the Box, and uh, also Ipsec videos, as, as I said before. Exactly, man. Ipsec is like amazing. I have a couple of, uh, if you click on my channel, you will see a couple of recommended channels. Ipsec is in there, of course, Live Overflow, also some smaller YouTubers. You should really check out Pink Draconian, by the way, if you guys yeah, like. Uh, <laughs> he's uh, a good friend of mine. Yeah, uh, I really like him. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys haven't seen him, uh, the viewers, you should really check him out. He's really insanely good with the boxes as well. And he explains them very in depth as well. That's what I like about him. Um, one last question, maybe. Where do you want to go with your life? Do you want to be a hacker forever? Or is it like something you want to do? So after school, mm -hmm. I want to be a red teamer. Okay. Maybe, uh, yeah, maybe a hacker red teamer. You know, uh, uh, and uh, also physical contesting uh, interests me. You know, getting into uh, and uh, buildings and uh, true locks. I want to be a physical pen tester. Yeah. That's really cool. I really like physical pen testers because most companies have no idea how badly yeah. they are secured, man. Yeah. It's insane. I work at some of the top companies in Belgium because I'm like, I'm sort of like a freelancer. So I often switch jobs and it's like insane how easy it is to get into those buildings where they keep everything, you know. Anyway, I would like to thank you very much for your time. It was amazing. I really loved this. We should do it again sometime. Thank you okay. very much. It's a pleasure. Thanks. Guys, viewers, if you enjoyed this, uh, Matt, do you want to have a shout out? Like, do you want to promote your Twitter channel or anything? No. And yes, so I will, uh, firstly, I want to uh, give credit to Zero XDF because his blog is amazing. Link in the description. He, he does uh, Hackneybox write ups too, in his posts, and uh, he writes uh, very in detail. All right, awesome, so, man. And uh, so I have a web page and a Twitter. Will be so, also in the description, by the way. All the links that we are talking about in the description. Thank you very much, Matt. I really enjoyed it. It was a pleasure. I hope you get very far. I think you will get very far in your hacker career. I see a lot of talent in you. Even though you don't see it yourself, you should look up the imposter syndrome. It's real, bro. <laughs> All right, man. A lot of love from Uncle Red. I hope I'll see you soon, man. Bye.